hopefully this afternoon we can give you some innovations, some thoughts, raise some things for you to think about when you get back to the office. I think we're going to move into an age now of contextualising and understanding that data. The future is fluid, you're going to need more investment with your technology in the future, so why not collaborate together? Simplify, be confident. Wherever we go, we all have three, four, five wireless connected devices on us and that we're using and we're consuming more and more data as we go. And ultimately, do they hit one of our targets? So do they buy something? Do they contact us? Do they pick up the phone? So what we're doing at Purple is we're recreating that data, but for real world spaces. We want to give the power back to the brands and the venues to own their own data and be able to use it. There is a huge shift to digital. Uh, consumers are becoming far more savvy. They'll increasingly look to mobile or online um, for what they want to do in terms of eating out, looking at reviews, or potentially looking at the best offer for where they can eat out. We've had quite a shift ourselves where we've had traditional paper vouchers, but we've now switched those to being electronic. And what Eagle Eye does is we enable those connections. We're a digital marketing enabler. Because what you can do in a connected world is you can monitor how your spend is working in real time across all your media channels. It's allowing us to bridge the online to offline world. And this is the way, this is an enabler for the future. So what does going digital give theatre tokens? Well, it gives us new sales channels. You walk in, you scan a barcode, whether it's on a phone, on a card, on a piece of paper, it doesn't matter. It's a simple process. And we've gone to see them and shown them the new platform and the new way they're going to be working and every single one of them has just said wow this is amazing why haven't we been doing it like this all along relevance equals getting the right sort of message to the right audience what is it about them that motivates them to engage with that product or service and how can we therefore craft a communication that makes them want to do that more so it leads us to insight which gives us tactics that we can take into activation it all hinges on data data rocks here you are back together again why are you working together again and you know what do you each bring to the other what's tell us about the relationship it doesn't surprise me, it wasn't planned, it doesn't surprise me that we've ended up working together in this space because we've always been interested in what people do uh, and the opportunities for business from better understanding people. If Purple and Eagle had existed 20 years ago, we, Tesco would have been their biggest customer. Can digital really replace the relationship that a, a, a consumer brand has with its customers? To be able to feel that your phone represents my Sainsbury, my Loblaws, my Pizza Express and does things that just feel right. If, if they ask me to spend a bit more money, they ask me to spend a bit more money on something that, yeah, I could probably do that rather than well, I don't even buy that stuff. What the hell are they doing? The reality is the minute you go into a shop, it's a black hole. They haven't got a blind clue what you're doing. And all really I'm saying and urging, and, and we, you know, we do it with Purple and we do it with Eagle Eye, is don't let your bricks and mortar spaces be a black hole. They don't have to be. And, and if you work with these two businesses and build the capability, actually what you know about your bricks and mortar space can be as rich as what you know about your website.